now the Mickey Mouse Club presents The New Adventures of Spin and Marty. Today's episode, The Rabbit Hunt. We hunt the boar, the wily boar, sing tum hey diddly yo. Through the woods we go with our trusty bow, sing tum hey diddly yo. Tonight we'll have a juicy roast, in a brown ale we'll drink a toast. And on the morrow, up be times a hunting we will go. Sing tum hey diddly, tum hey diddly, tum hey diddly yo. Great Robin Hood will free the maid, tum hey diddly yo. He'll bring her here to the forest glade, tum hey diddly yo. Then they'll be wed by Friar Tuck, he'll bless them with St. Martin's luck. And my love gives born for the last month's eat his fill of coal. Tum hey diddly, tum hey diddly, tum hey diddly yo. It looks real good, kids, but let's try it again and put a little more life into it, okay? Okay. I love thee, sweet maid Marian. But I love thee not, Sir Guy. Thou couldst learn. Nay, thou knowest that I love Robin Hood. Robin Hood. Bah! That's better, Spin, much better. Thanks, Annette. Quite a character, that Sir Guy. He was at that. So was Robin Hood, Lady Marian, too. Those two were in love, I guess. Who? Robin Hood and Maid Marian. Uh huh. It's kind of a funny deal, isn't it? What? Oh, you know, falling in love and getting married and things like that. I think it's sort of nice. Yeah, I guess it is at that. How old are you, Annette? Sixteen. Girls get all the breaks. In what way? Well, when a, when a girl's sixteen, she can get married if she wants to. But a guy has to wait until he's 21 or so. Some boys get married when they're only 19. Oh, yeah, if they're going into the service or something. But a guy really shouldn't get married until he's got a job. Or at least knows what he's going to do. I mean, what kind of career he's going to pick or what kind of business. That's what I think, Spin. He should at least be, well, sort of started out in life so he can support a girl before he gets married. My folks feel that way, too. It helps out, I guess. Kind of expensive getting married. Uh, well, shall we get on with the play? I guess we'd better. This last year dinner. Now you fellas have yourselves a banquet. I can't talk to you guys today, because I gotta have Speck and Ambitious put out the programs for the show. Now you guys be good. Nightmare. 
serves him right after eating six hot dogs. For Pete's sake, how can anybody get any sleep around here with all this yakking going on? like a shot. Rabbits, they ran away. Somebody left the door open and we're helping him catch him. Oh, they picked a fine time, three o'clock in the morning. I say, what's going on? Well, Moochie's rabbits got out. Oh, dear. Nobody's gonna hurt you. Come on, bunny. Nice little bunny. Come on, bunny. Nice little bunny. Come on, bunny. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, I guess that's it. Ten, but there should be twenty of them. Well, I'm sorry, Mooch. I guess the rest of them have taken to the range by now. The range? We better hurry up and go get them. Hey, no, you don't, young fella. You're not going anywhere. You're marching straight back to bed. We've had about enough excitement around here for one night. But they'll starve to death and die. Now, now, Moochie, don't get excited. There's plenty of grass and stuff out there in the range for them to eat. There is? Why, sure. And before you know it, they'll be moving in with their country cousins. 
Who's their country cousin? Oh, you know, all the little wild rabbits like the cottontails and the jackrabbits. Will they take good care of them? Don't worry, Junior. They'll take care of themselves. Now, you get on back to bed pronto. Are you sure? I'm sure. Okay. Oh, that moochie. He's gonna be the death of me yet. Here you are, sir. Thanks, Perkins. <laughs> What's the matter with you? Oh, 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 oh. Now, how do you suppose that ever happened, sir? <laughs> <laughs> Next episode, The Ghost of Anne Berlin.